We've got a parcel! Yes, 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 yes. Hello. Yes, 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 yes. Let's check this out. Finally. Welcome to the, another video. Now I've been waiting to this video for whew, six or seven weeks to be honest. And basically I, uh, with the fact that we're all in this pandemic and we're all in lockdown and quarantine, um, I ordered um, these resistance bands. Well, these resistance bands um, I ordered because my other ones that, I, that I've had for like 10 years, they, um, they snap. But I was looking through throughout couple of days found some good ones that I wanted with the right clasps because I don't want ones that, that click together and they look flimsy and shitty or plastic so basically um, I ordered these uh, resistance bands and they, I don't know if, it, if it's these ones that have arrived or it's the other two sets that I've ordered that, um, that have arrived one of them arrived uh, that is because basically um, I got a refund off eBay because I put a spew in that I couldn't track it. Then I got a refund, like I said. And so I ordered two sets because basically these resistant bands, they work, they, they, they add up to about 100 pounds, which sounds quite a bit, but I Googled 100 pounds into kilograms. It's about 45 kilograms, which is all right to start with, but when I'm lifting, when I'm bench pressing 80 odd, 80 odd kilograms and I'm deadlifting 140 kilograms, 45 isn't going to cut it. So I ordered two because basically 90 kilograms is better than 45 kilograms. Basically these bands could be the um, lost in the post ones and I could be getting two more sets. Then I'll have 135 kilograms which would, which would be awesome. But if they are lost in the post, then I'm just getting two lots of bands. At least I'm getting two lots of decent bands. I can try and do some different things around the house. Let's get to it, shall we? And by the way, thanks again for tuning in. Um, been waiting for these for so long to do some home workout stuff because we can't go. And I'm also decided that um, I think I'm going to, once I get my next house, or I'm going to start buying stuff over the months and few years or whatever. If you want to keep, um, if you want to subscribe and if I follow my journey, better myself, better my physique, better my strength. I'm going to eventually get um, get my own home gym, basically, like with the, all the proper um, power rack with all the bars and the everything like that. I want to do that so I can do videos and think, well, I've bought this gear, I can use it. So anyway, what's in the bag, as they might say? Well, it comes with this pretty cool... Uh, storage bag which is good, means the bands are everywhere. I wanted these clips basically. I was looking around for um, resistance bands with that kind of clip on. It's more like, it's, I think it's called a monkey, monkey clip or a D-link, I'm not quite sure. If you know what they're called, um, put, put it down, let me know in the comments below what they are. D-links, they use them a lot on, on um, climbing, but usually on these climb ones they have them, but they twist it like to lock it into place. I wanted those because they seem a bit more strong so these are quite good so apparently one is at 30 one's at 25 these are pound one's at 15 one's at 10 i think one's at five i may be wrong but you get all these bands you get this which is mint because you can go around the pole and put it through there and like that or you can you put this over a door the end of a door and you hook the bands into there and the door, it stops the door moving. You can do all like nice movements, like chest movements, stuff like that, or leg movements. It's just like an, it's like an anchor, basically. It looks pretty cool. These, these are two, I think these are um, um, like ankle straps. You put them around your ankle or around your foot, for instance. Uh, and you can do some like up and down stuff, you know, um, for your chest, your upper arms, your biceps, your triceps, your glutes yeah. which comes to it the two handle things which obviously when you're doing exercises you want to need handles 
nice grips to, to, to clip them to clip these uh, bands on. So let's have a look at these bands, shall we? So the black one. So it doesn't tell me. It seems it doesn't tell me what the weights are, but um, it says that the uh, the black one, this one, is thirty pounds, which is I don't know, which is uh, the the the, um, the most uh, strenuous one, basically the, the most tough one. It's all curled up. This light green one is twenty five pounds. Is twenty pounds. That one, red one, is apparently fifteen pounds, and finally the yellow one is ten pounds. Effectively, one hundred pounds in weight, all in all in these distance bands, and it works out. Like I said, googled it to see how much in, in kilograms, because obviously in the UK it's um, we we do things in um, kilograms. The US and other countries, I'm guessing, maybe Australia, I'm not sure, but definitely in the US, um, they're all in pounds. So that came in pounds, but I converted it down in 45 kilos. Isn't a lot, but it'll do to start with. So yeah, that is uh, the first set that's either, of either two or three, if if this one's the one that was lost in the post. I'd love it if this one was the lot one that got lost in the post. That means I'd get another two sets. And that'd be sweet. I also got, um, which I got a refund for, which, which I found out. I got um, this band. Um, this band is a uh, is for basically I'm going to use it for um, for, for warm stretches, like doing stuff like that. And apparently, this one, the strength of this one is is 25 to 65 pounds. It goes from 11 kilograms to. 30 kilograms. That's basically the, how strong this is, and it does feel very strong. I bought another one, a red one, which is less strenuous because um, I didn't know what I'd ordered originally. So I thought I'd order another one. I thought, you know, let's see if if um, I went up to the one is really up to about a, up to about a 20 kilogram um, was of resistance. So that's good. I got this one. I got a red one. I've got. Um, Another, like I said, some more of these coming. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, I know there aren't many recent, I've googled and YouTubed resistance bands workout, and the last videos I saw online were two years ago about these. So hopefully, um, this is more of a what's in the box, and um, the next one will be me showing various things of what I'm going to use it for and what you can use it for. There's nothing that tells you how to use it, how to lift like that. So I'm going to see how you use it, see if it's enough for me. Because I'm going to try and use my coffee table here as like a bench. I might even try doing it with some back ones as well. I'm going to go in the door at the top, the door at the top of here, hook that, um, hook this in to the top of it and see if I can do some, some like proper fly weights which is going to be good. Put it under my feet and see if I can do some like chest ones like that. Um, see what I can do and if it works out. And uh, yeah, let's get back to it. Well, like I said, thank you again for watching. This wasn't the best video in the world. I wanted to show that basically. My, my um, recent workout videos, have, I know they've been crap. I've only got like 30, 20, 30 views in like the space of weeks. They're not the best. And there's too many home workout videos of using no equipment so I thought I'd get these resistant bands and let's see just if they are good and if they do give us a pump and what and what is going on with it so like I said um, if you haven't already click the like button click the subscribe button follow me and um, this is might have been a shitty video like just open the open box of my excitement of finally getting an actual um, resistant bands workout kit which I actually am really excited about I can't wait to try it more videos I'm editing at the minute I'm doing one about my motorbike, but not riding it as I'm not allowed to ride it. Uh, I went on my motor on my pedal bike the other day, um, so I'm going to be talking about that soon about how exhilarating it was. Um, and how I did like 20 miles in like just over two hours on the canal, and that was actually quite good because I hadn't been on a bike for 10 years. I was quite chuffed, my knees were hurting, they're not so much anymore. But anyway, if you like this video, thumbs up, subscribe, like, comment. And there's plenty more videos down in my, in my um, channel, like motorbike videos, wine tasting videos, 
ex daft exercise videos, um, scheme videos, DIY videos, all that stuff. So anyway, thanks again. I'll see you all very, very soon for another, well, I hope, amazing and fun video for you guys to enjoy. Bye-bye.